Yesterday I went to DC to the National Portrait Gallery, which is one of my favorite museums, to go see a Google Glass exhibit that is only going to be on for um, about a weekend, which uh, which is still strange to me. I don't know why they they limited the time period for this, but um, it, it, it turned out that the line was too long for this exhibit, so I ended up going around looking at some other stuff. And uh, I guess I was in a very receptive mood because I think um, I stopped and spent a lot of time looking at all the the weird modern paintings where there were there's stuff coming in and out of in and out of canvases, weird warped uh, sculptures and and uh, canvases with cobwebs on it. Um, I was so so receptive to all this stuff. In fact, uh, it gave me a headache. And um, I went into this pitch black room where there was this uh, film playing and there were a few people in there. I went into a corner that was so dark that you probably couldn't see me because I'm wearing a dark coat. And um, it was called Fall into Paradise. And it's a 10 minute long film where you see this black dot on this screen that slowly grows into, um, over a period of 10 minutes, it grows into uh, this couple that's sort of embracing. They're falling slowly towards the camera. And uh, that's it's it's about eight minutes of a dot on on a screen growing into into that thing, and uh, I was watching it, and I don't think um, I wasn't at all thinking about what it meant or why it had been created, but but I was more um, I was more interested in the fact that I was I was zoning out, which I find myself doing when I look at a lot of modern art, asking myself, um, it was just sort of figuring out I- ideas and having having weird images come into my mind. And, uh, I remember getting this, this particular idea of a a triangle person with, uh, some Beyonce videos playing inside of it. And, um, I thought it was really weird and I wanted to just draw it out. And, um, so eventually those, those, those tiny people on that screen fall into a huge puddle of blue water. It was pretty beautiful. Um, very loud splashing, and so they're swimming around um, in this um, in the blue water for about yeah, like I said before, for about two minutes. And um, I never got to go see the Google Glass. Like I said, the line line was too long. But um, I have come to appreciate those moments when I'm in museums and I come across strange ideas, or I'm looking at something, and although I don't get it. Or I might be confused. It sort of makes me. Uh, it generates these strange images in my mind. So I do appreciate that, and I'll eventually get to uh, try on some Google glasses anyway.